Hey there everyone, welcome back to a brand new episode of Let's Play Undertale. So this guy. That dog considers itself an artist, but it doesn't ever know what to create. It probably doesn't help that its brain is the size of a piece of kibble. Why would you roast the doggo like this? Done nothing but good things. It's a good doggo. Uh, I think I did this wrong already. Yep. I goofed it up, I think. Wait, maybe not. Oh, yep. Yeah. Never mind. It's a lump of snow with the word sans written on it in red marker. It's a snow papyrus. Complete with a scarf. So I think. Aha! Gave us a little bridge there. With snow. Cute. What's up? What are these eyes? Hey, hey, wait, how what? Say, are you following me? I've been bamboozled. A jife trot, gift trot, confronts you. Um. Some teams decorated it as a prank. Ho ho ho! Go ahead and laugh. Sure what to do there. Ah, the scent of fresh pine nuts. That's uh, undecorated. You remove a box of non-dog related reasons. That's a little better. Hey, 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 hey. Is slightly less irritated. Remove a childhood photograph of Snowdrake and his parent. That's a little better. Hey, hey. Ow. My dude. Remove the striped cane that says I use this tiny cane to walk on it. A weight has been lifted. Problems have been taken away. Spare you. Oh god. Hideous face. Get out of here. It's a door. It's a door. I want some glowing mushrooms. Alright, whatever. I don't know what that door's for. I'm sure I'll comment about it, whatever the door is later. I'll put that up on, uh, you know, the screen later. Hmm. Hmm. Let's see this this way. It's a snow puff. And this is a snow puff. This, however, is a snow puff. What a tiny doghouse. Woof. Surprisingly, it's a snow puff. Snow puff. Is it really a snow puff? Behold! A snow puff. Eh? There's 30G inside this. What is this? It's a snow puff. That's not a snow puff. That's a doggo. It's a cute pupper. It's a, it's a big pupper. It's the greater dog. Made up of smaller dogs. Dog spear, dog fist. Dog face. Greater dog. It's too far away to pet. You just pet the air. Ow, ow, ow. Jeez, you bark loud as hell. Jeez. Watching you intently. Come here. Come here, greater dog. Bounce towards you, flecking slobber into your face. No, stop it. Stop barking at me. Oh my god. 
I just died to the damn dog. You cannot give up just yet. A two. Stay determined. Oh, I started. Really Man, all right. I'll meet you over there by the dog again. Alright, doggo, this time don't kill me. Traitor dog. Come. That, that, that. Okay. Seeking affection. Let's pet the greater dog. It gets so comfortable, it falls asleep. Then it wakes up. It's so excited. It's a puffer. Ow. Hiding the ground with its front paws. It's plate. Spots on the ground. Greater dog picks up all the snow in the area and brings it to you. Now the dog is very tired. He rests its head on you. Aw. Hey, 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 hey. No barking at me. Stop it. Uh, pet it again. It sinks its entire weight into you. Your movement slows. But you still haven't pet enough. Stop barking at me. Pet capacity is 40%. You pet decisively. Pet capacity reaches 100%. The dog flops over with his legs hanging in the air. Hey, chill with the barks. Greater dog is contented. Some of your rubs are forbidden. Ow. I was supposed to stop moving for it. Fine. You missed out on the tummy rubs. <laughs> All the dog faces actually became smiles. Nice. Aww, look at you. Up, oh, greater dog. I think I think you're in there backwards, buddy. Ah, the brothers. Human! This is your final and most dangerous challenge! Behold! The Gauntlet of Deadly Terror! Featuring a mace, a spear, a flamethrower. When I say the word, it will fully activate. Cannons will fire, spikes will sling, swing, blades will slice, each part will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest of chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it. A cannon, two spears, a mace, a flamethrower, and a dog. Well, what's the hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I'm, I'm about to activate it now. Mm-hmm. That, uh, doesn't look very active. Well, this challenge, it seems maybe too easy to defeat the human with. Here, we can't use this one. I'm a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair, and my traps are expertly cooked. But this method is too direct, no class at all. Anyway, it goes. Oh, bring the dog back, though. Phew. What are you looking at? 
This is another decisive victory for Papyrus. Yeah. Heh. <laughs> eh? I mean, question mark? I don't know what my brother's going to do now. If I were you, I would make sure I understand blue attacks. I don't know why I just suddenly switched him to like this weird Bronx, New York style of accent. But welcome to Snowden. The sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. Save that up. Um, we're gonna put the snowman in the ice cream there. But oh yeah, that's right. We did get the tough glove last time. Forgot about that. Let's go ahead and equip that. You equipped the tough glove. Hello, traveler. How can I help you? Hmm. I want to kind of give her an eclipse of voice, but I don't know how to do an eclipse of voice. It's by the manly bandana. It has abs on it. Oh, a bicycle. Heals 11 HP twice. Hmm. I got one of those. And a cinnamon bun. Say hello. Hiya. Welcome to Snowden. Hmm, no. Hiya. Mm -mm, nope. Hiya. Meh. <laughs> I'm gonna get this voice right. Hiya. Hiya. There we go. Let's do that one. Hiya. Welcome to Snowden. I can't remember the last time I saw a fresh face around here. Where did you come from? The capital? You don't look like a tourist. Are you here by yourself? You want to know what to do here in Snowden? Groby's has food and the library has information. If you're tired, you can take a nap at the inn. It's right next door. My sister runs it. And if you're bored, you can sit outside and watch those wacky skeletons do their thing. There's two of them. Brothers, I think. They just showed up one day and asserted themselves. The town has gotten a lot more interesting since then. Think back at your think back to your history class. A long time ago, monsters lived in the ruins back there in the forest. Long story short, we all decided to leave the ruins and head off to the end of the caverns. Along the way, some fuzzy folk decided they liked the cold and set up camp at Snowden. Oh, and don't think about trying to explore the ruins. The door's been locked for ages, so unless you're a ghost or can burrow under the door, forget about it. Life is the same as usual. A little claustrophobic. But, we all know deep down that freedom is coming, don't we? As long as we got that hope, we can grit our teeth and face the same struggles day after day. That's life, ain't it? Wow. I, I, I feel that way too hard. Alright, thank you, Cinnamon Bun Lady. Bye now. Come again sometime. Maybe. And this is our sister who runs the inn. Welcome to Snowed Inn, Snowed Inn's premier hotel. One night is 80G. I do not have 80G. Well, feel free to come back anytime. Oh, hey, whoa. Um, I guess that's a thing. It's a mailbox overflowing with unread junk mail. This mailbox is labeled Papyrus. Look inside. It's empty. So this has got to be Sans's mailbox. It's locked. It's locked from the inside. Uh, I mean, I guess we gotta go this way, right? Oh, I can't see! Human. Allow me to tell you some complex feelings. Feelings like the joy of finding another pasta lover, the admiration for another's puzzle solving skills, the desire to have a cool smart per- yeah. The desire to have a cool smart per- God, I can't read today. The desire to have a cool smart person think you are cool. These feelings, they must be what you are feeling right now. I can hardly imagine what it must be like to feel that way. After all, I am very great. 
I don't ever wonder having what having lots of friends is like. I pity you, lonely human. Worry not. You shall be lonely no longer. I could not read. I, the great papyrus, will be your... No. No, this is all wrong. I can't be your friend. You're a human. I must capture you. Then I can fulfill my lifelong dream. Powerful, popular, prestigious. That's Papyrus, the newest member of the Royal Guard. It's fight time. Papyrus and the Bone Drizzle block the way. Flirt rhythm. What? Flirting? So you finally reveal your ultimate feelings. Well, I'm a skeleton with very high standards. Oh no! You're meeting all my standards! I guess this means I have to go on a date with you? Let's date a little later, after I capture you. Papyrus is thinking about what to wear for his date. Whenever I hear this, I in the back of my head, I'm listening to the metal remix that has Toxic X Eternity in it by, um, I can't remember his name right now, but he does a lot of metal remixes. Oh no! Let's date later, after I capture you. The pirate's thinking about what to cook for his date. Mercy! So you won't fight. Then, let's see if you can handle my fabled blue attack. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm -hmm. Nice try. You're blue now. That's my attack. Yeah! Hey, there's the bop. I wonder what I should wear. So yeah, now that you're a blue heart, there's gravity. And the longer you hold the up arrow, the longer you jump. The pirate. The pirate dabs marinara sauce behind his ear. What? I'm not thinking about that date thing. <laughs> Papyrus Dabs MTT Brand Vichy Cream. Hold up longer to jump higher, jeez! Yup, 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 yup. I said that already, Papyrus. Jeez. Okay, I cleared it. Papyrus Dabs MTT Brand Anime Powder behind his ear. White? What ears? Yeah, don't make me use my special attack. Whoop. MTT brand cute juice behind his ear. What ear? I can almost taste my future popularity. Enough. Please, out. Stop. Oop. MTT brand attraction slime behind his ear. All right. Papyrus. Head of the Royal God! Oh, oh, that, 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 this is not Flappy Birds. <gasps> okay. Papyrus Dam's beauty yogurt behind his ear. Papyrus unparalleled. <laughs> I need to stop reading, Jesus Christ. Unparalleled Spaghettator! Nope. Ow. Realizes he doesn't have ears. Where have you been dabbing him to, man? Undyne will be really proud of me. Hmm. Nice clear. Running back. You stop that, Papyrus. Papyrus is preparing a bone attack. The king will trim a hedge in my shape of my smile. 
Smells like bones. My brother, well, he won't change very much. Ow. What the fuck? I need to use it up. I need to use something. I need to use something. H2. Bicycle. He won't have the bicycle. Recovery 11 HP. I'll have lots of admirers. But. No, no, no. Ooh, just cleared it. Papyrus is considering his option. Will anyone like me as sincerely as you? Papyrus, please stop with this. Bonkers. A turn. Ow, flappy bird, you bitch. What the? What the? Stop with the flappy bird nonsense. Papyrus is rattling his bones. A unicycle. <laughs> Someone like you is really rare. Whoa. Oh my gosh. The fire is just trying really hard to play cool. And dating might be kind of hard. Ow. Is it? Please. The fire is just trying really hard to play cool. After you're captured and sent away. Ow, ow, ow. Papyrus, please! Stop it! Jesus! Papyrus prepares a non bone attack and then spends a minute fixing his mistake. Instant regret spaghetti. I eat the cinnamon bunny. Uh, who cares? Give up! Ow, 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 ow! Papyrus is preparing a bone attack. Give up or face my special attack! Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ow, I flew right into that one. Papyrus is trying really hard to play it cool. Yeah! Very soon I'll use my special attack! Alright, Papyrus, you can do it. Ow, come on, man. Gravity. It's not fair. Papyrus is rattling his bones. Too long, and I'll use that attack. Ow. Uh. Papyrus is cackling. This is your last chance before my special attack. Oh, sweet Jesus. Please stop with. Not the Flappy Bird. Not the Flappy Bird. Not the Flappy Bird. Blech. Jesus. Uh, I, I, I don't have any healing items. Oh, no. Mercy. Behold. My special attack! What the heck? That's my special attack! Hey, you stupid dog! Do you hear me? Stop munching on that bone! Hey, what are you doing? Come back here with my special attack! Oh well. I'll just use a really cool regular attack. Papyrus is getting ready for a regular attack. Uh, here's an absolutely normal attack. You're too weak. I was easily able to capture you. I will now send you to the capture zone. Or, as Sans calls it, our garage. You're in the doghouse now. <laughs> Man, that's not fair. But yeah. Papyrus, you, you do this all the time, buddy. I'm gonna just walk right out. Thanks. So, unfortunately, I lost. That's no bueno. I'm gonna do that again. I'm gonna skip past all the silly billy dialogue there. Oh, where could that human have gone? Wait, it's right in front of me. Hello, I was worried you'd gotten lost. It's sure at least to know that you're right here. Wait a second, you're not supposed to escape. Get back in there. Alright, we're gonna do that again this time with feeling. Flirt. Let's see it later. Alright, so it just starts me off right here. Awesome. Flappy bird attack. Yep, 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 I'm not thinking about it. Yep, yep, yep. Nope. 
Almost taste my future popularity. No. No. Ow. Just hit that. The virus, head of the royal guard. Nope. Why the flappy bird attack? Ow. I'm down to eight. This is no way no. I'm probably gonna die this time again. Oh, come on! Fair. Well, you may have cleverly escaped from your jail before. This time, I've upgraded the facilities. Not only will you be trapped, but you won't even want to leave. <laughs> oh, I'm so boosted. Hold on, before I go to fight him again. Isn't my little cinnamon just the cutest? It's a bunny walking a bunny. And a lady over there. Something about her disturbs me. I think I figured it out. No, never mind. Bun, 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 bun. I'm gonna give this papyrus fight one more try tonight. And if it don't work out well, then I'm gonna just leave the episode up there. And then just, uh, blah, blah, blah. I really wanna beat the fight though. Like, I'd, I'd feel really bad if I can't beat papyrus. Like, papyrus isn't even that hard of a fight. I'm just playing poorly. Like, really, really, really poorly. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. I'm ignoring all your dialogue. Mercy, spare, blue attack. Boom. Boom. Up. Mercy. Ow. I am already off to a terrible start. Alright, so. Going up longer to jump higher, yep. Come on, that's some garbage. out of here. You want to stay as close to me as you possibly can. Or just not. Pay attention to sh shice. Alright, there we go. Oh, come on. Just to make sure I made it up. Okay. 
Oh, that song. All right. Oh my god, the skin. Oh, for that one. Oh, come on, I was out of that one. Oh, that's a hawk. Stop, please. Why you bully me? Oh, why you bully me? Why you bully me? You believe me? Alright. Grammatically right. wrong, because the correct form would be not as persistent as the persistent. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this lesson. <laughs> oh, I'm so bad at games recently, I don't know why. I'm, I'm getting bodied in everything. I got bodied in the Let's Retro for Shining Force and for Comic Zone. I got bodied in this. Oh man, I'm I'm just doing piss poor today. Either way, guys, we'll actually make some progress next time. I will catch you all here next time on Let's Play. I was about to say Shining Force, Jesus. Let's play Undertale, where we actually beat Papyrus and progress the rest of the actual story. But other than that, guys, I will catch you all here next time. If you liked today's episode, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Go ahead and leave a comment down below. Hit that subscribe button if you aren't already subscribed, and. Hit that notification bell. That way, whenever I drop a new episode, you guys already know when it's up. Other than that, guys, I will catch you all here next time on Let's Play Undertale.